10 Most Powerful Earthquakes in Earth History. In this video, we're going to show you all known earthquakes measured or estimated to have a magnitude of 8.5 or above on the moment magnitude, which has caused havoc every time they occurred. If this has you intrigued, continue the video. Great Alaska Earthquake of 1964. The 1964 Alaska earthquake is also known as the Good Friday Earthquake, which occurred on March 27th at 5.36 p.m. AST on Good Friday. It claimed the lives of 131 people and lasted for good four minutes. The quake had a 9.2 magnitude, making it the most powerful recorded earthquake in North American history and the second most powerful in world history. The ground fissures, soil liquefaction, landsliding, and other ground havoc caused major structural damage in several communities, which caused an overall damage of 311 million US dollars. Most of the damage was sustained by the city of Anchorage, which is 120 kilometers northwest of the epicenter. Valdivia, Chile, 1960. The Valdivia earthquake of 22 May 1960 is the most powerful earthquake ever recorded in history. Various studies indicated that the magnitude of the earthquake is 9.4 to 9.6. It lasted 10 minutes. The Valdivia earthquake triggered a tsunami that had an effect on most of the Pacific, including southern Chile, Japan, the Philippines, eastern New Zealand, Southeast Asia, Hawaii, and the Aleutian Islands. The earthquake killed over 1,600 people, injured 3,000, and displaced 2 million. It also prompted 550 million US dollars in damage in Chile. The rapture zone of the earthquake was more than 1,000 kilometers long, the nearby volcano Puyehu also erupted after the two days of the initial quake. Assam, Tibet The 1950 Assam, Tibet earthquake occurred at Zizang, India border region on August 15th. It is also known as the Assam earthquake and had a moment magnitude of 8.6. The earthquake resulted in demolishing many buildings, which killed between 1,500 and 3,000 people. Following the earthquake, Large landslides blocked the Sabanshiri River. The natural dam broke eight days later, which created a wave of seven meters high, which flooded several villages and killed 536 people. It also made five million people homeless. The quake was the sixth largest earthquake in the 20th century. Kamchatka. Although the earthquake had an estimated magnitude of 9.0, but incredibly no person was killed, and the only casualties occurred were 3,000 miles away, which killed three cows in the resulting tsunami. The tsunami caused widespread damage in the Hawaiian Islands. The property damaged was around 1 million US dollars. Right after the earthquake, the majority of the Severo Kursk citizens skipped to the surrounding hills, where they managed to escape the first wave. However, as most of them returned to town and were killed by the second wave. According to the reports, 2,336 died out of a population of 6,000 people. The survivors were evacuated to continental Russia, where the settlement was then rebuilt in another location. Sumatra Earthquake Sumatra Earthquake is one of the deadliest earthquakes to occur in the current history. It is also known as the 2004 Indian Ocean Earthquake, which took place on 26 December with the epicenter off the west coast of Sumatra, Indonesia. The shock had a magnitude of 9.1 to 9.3. The undersea megathrust quake also occurred because of the Indian plate was subducted by the Burma plate and set off a series of catastrophic tsunamis, killing 230,000 people in almost 14 countries. This also inundated coastal communities with waves up to 30 meters high. The hardest hit country was Indonesia, followed by Sri Lanka, India, and Thailand. This is the third largest earthquake ever recorded on a seismograph, which had the longest duration of faulting ever witnessed, between 8.3 and 10 minutes. Northern Sumatra, Indonesia. The Northern Sumatra quake occurred on 11 April 2012. It had a magnitude of 8.6, and these were unusually strong intraplate earthquakes and the largest strike-slip earthquake ever recorded. There were more than a thousand people who were killed, with hundreds more injured, mostly in Nias, in northern Sumatra, Indonesia. The earthquake just hit months after an even bigger earthquake destroyed the region. 
The region, which is also the site of the 2004 Boxing Day tsunami, is especially geologically active, with three of the 15 biggest known earthquakes having happened here. Near the east coast of Honshu, Japan. Striking near the coast of Honshu, this earthquake managed to kill over 15,000 people, along with displacing another 13,000. It had a magnitude of 9.0 that occurred on Friday, 11th of March, 2011, also called the 2011 Tohoku earthquake. It was recorded as the most powerful quake ever to hit Japan. The damage caused by the quake totaled more than $309 billion, making it the most high-cost natural disaster in history. The ensuing tsunami reached the height upwards of 97 feet locally that affected the entire Pacific. The quake was large enough to cause an ice shelf to collapse in Antarctica. The waves also defiled a nuclear power plant in Fukushima. Rat Islands, Alaska The 1965 Rat Islands earthquake took place on February 4th that raptured 600-kilometer segment of the Aleutian Islands. It had a magnitude of 8.7, and the worst of the damage was caused by the resulting tsunami, which was around 35 feet high. The wave caused inundating on Omchitka Island, causing $10,000 in property damage. However, no deaths or injuries were reported. Ecuador Colombia Earthquake This earthquake happened in 1906 on January 31st off the coast of Ecuador near Esmeraldas. The quake had a moment magnitude of 8.8 .8 that triggered a tsunami up to 16 feet high, which killed between 500 and 1,500 people. The tsunami had an effect on the entire Pacific that reached the shores of Japan 20 hours later. Offshore Mali, Chile The 2010 Mali earthquake, which is also known as the 2010 Chile earthquake, happened off the coast of central Chile on 27 February. It occurred about three kilometers off the coast of Peluhu, commune in the Malay region, Chile. The Chile earthquake ranks as the fifth largest earthquake to be recorded by a seismograph. It was strongly felt in about six Chilean regions that together make up 80% of the country's population. It killed over 500 people, reporting 25 people missing, and the total economic loss was more than 30 billion US dollars. The quake had a magnitude of 8.8 .8 on the moment magnitude scale, along with intense shaking, lasting for about three minutes. There were several coastal towns in south-central Chile that were devastated by the tsunami ensued by the earthquake.